Let's do a clean with me video. Welcome back, I'm Brittany. This is Pennies Into Pearls where you can come for motivation and tips on all things related to enjoying your life as a family. Today's video, I'm gonna take you around the house with me and just do a good deep clean. You know there's those things that just like build up over time and every time you open that one cupboard or every time you walk past that one baseboard, it just brings like immediate anxiety to your life. We're gonna take care of that today. So without further ado, come with me and let's go clean. All right, first things first is we have to tackle the laundry. Well, we'll get it started. I like to start a load of laundry. I'm actually probably gonna start with the bedding now that I think of it. But I like to put in a load of laundry because, hello, the laundry machine does the work for you. I can get that going and then multitask on other things while the laundry's going. Over the past year, I've been putting my mental and financial focus on things that have more clean ingredients. And so I'm not just talking about the foods that we're putting into our body, but also all the other products that we have in our home, especially the ones that are on or up against our skin all day long. Today's video sponsor helps with this in a huge way. Thank you True Earth for supporting Pennies Into Pearls and being today's video sponsor. True Earth's focus is providing a line of products that are eco-friendly and created with clean ingredients. All three of my kids struggle with sensitive skin and more specifically, they all have really dry skin if we're not careful. I've been using True Earth's laundry strips for the last two months and the biggest thing I've noticed is that my kids' skin has noticeably improved. True Earth is certified paraben-free, phosphate-free, free of added dyes, free of chlorine bleach, and is hypoallergenic. Now why is it important that we don't want those things in or around our bodies? because they can have a negative effect, not only on our skin, but also on our internal health. So not only do they have really great ingredients, but they also are super easy to use. All you have to do is tear off a strip. Sometimes I'll use two strips for those like really dirty loads of laundry, like the kids. Throw it into the washer and let it do its cleaning thing for you. What's also awesome about their strips is they are super easy to store and don't take up much space at all. So not only does this help keep your laundry room organized, it also helps eliminate unnecessary waste. If you wanna give True Earth a try, click the link in the description box below and make sure to use this code to get 10% off your order. I think the biggest thing I need to take care of are these windows. The inside are actually cleaned. I just need to clean the outside. It's probably gonna be hard for you to see. Is it hard for you to see? Yeah, it's hard for you to see. But trust me when I say that these windows are dirty. They're dirty. Let's clean them. Okay, this window right here is missing the little dingle hoppers to pull it out. So if you just take a handy dandy fork, oh no, oh no, yeah, there you go. No, no, do we need to go from the outside maybe? Let's go try the outside, there we go. Oh yeah, there we go, that's what we needed. Popped it out a little. Now I'm hoping, yeah, got it. That's not for you, get down, go, shoot. Okay, there we go. Now we're talking, look at those clean windows. Oh, they're so clean, I love them. All right, are you ready for a heavy dose of reality? Okay, we don't have a laundry room. But out in our garage, this is our laundry. <laughs> oh, it's not good. We need to clean it up. Let's do this.
so when we moved into this house, they had, you know, remnants of uh, carpet. So we just kind of pieced it together. It's seen better days, that's for sure. There we go. So now we just have a few of those things, that stuff, right here with our washer and dryer. One day we'll get to make over this space and make it cute, have a nice rug, but for now, it gets the laundry clean and that's what's important. Does anyone else's house just seem to like explode? when the kids get home. I mean, look at it. Look at those crumbs. Just everything, everything, everywhere. It's worth it, I love them. I do love them, it's okay. All right, let's get this cleaned up. Hold on. Let's take a minute to enjoy the scenery. Listen to the birds. Okay. Where do you guys store your giant bags of potatoes? I just don't have a good storage spot. Right there will do for now. with these pegs. I will never again buy chairs with these pegs. I mean, this is, this one is taped together, falling apart. That's not even the worst one. This one over here, ay ay ay, can you see? It's just like, these come out all the time. This one's popped out in the back. This is just like a lawsuit waiting to happen. So not only do they break really easily with little kids, but having to clean in between each and every single one of these, if you don't stay on top of it, man, it gets really gross. So dear future self, when we're shopping for chairs again, let's not make that mistake. Oh yeah, there we go. Now that's clean. Did you know hubby and I made this together? We did. Way back in the day when pennies into pearls like first started, we built this table together. I love it. I won't ever be able to get rid of it. We had so much fun making it together. I can't wait for more projects together with our house remodel. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Okay, side note. Does anybody have any recommendations for water bottle storage? Water bottles, water bottles, they're everywhere and I actually just got rid of probably 10 of them. But I mean, they all have a purpose. The kids have theirs, I have mine, we have like our protein shaker bottles, I don't know. I need a good organization system and I probably, what I really need to do is like go through these cupboards and be like, okay, what do I actually use? And then use some of that space for organizing stuff like the water bottles. Does anyone else wash their dishes by hand? Do you have a dishwasher? I know some people prefer to wash them by hand. I prefer a dishwasher, but I just don't have one. I do have a dishwashing strategy. You start with the cups, things like this, so they stack in nicely. Then you move on to the bowls, so that way when they're drying, they can stack nicely on top like this, 
little then big items so they can stack over like so. Then you end with the silverware. but there's a few things I had to stop and help the kids with but I'm feeling great I can't even describe how amazing it feels to have the windows all cleaned up like it's gonna stay like that for at least two hours <laughs> maybe who knows windows are a hard thing to keep clean when you have little hands and that's okay so let me know how did you like this clean with me video um if I do another one, if you guys like it, I'll do another one. What are some things you want me to include in these clean with me videos? Do you like the tips? Do you just like the satisfaction of like seeing things cleaned? Because I mean, that's kind of how I like it. But let me know. And don't forget to go check out True Earth. I have that link in the description for you so you can go over there, check them out, and use that code when you put in your first order. Thanks you guys so much for watching. If you're new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.